Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I just wanted to make a really quick public service announcement video basically for the 2024 Wired Freedom. Now anytime I have an issue with this bike, no matter how big or small, I'm going to let you guys know about it. And one really important thing that came up, which is a really easy fix and happens on almost any bike, is on this crank here, when I was riding my uh, best case scenario long range test where I stayed in pedal assist one, I did many 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 miles on this bike and I'm a decent way through I started having issues with my crank pedal starting to wobble and creak and then I noticed at the very very end it was so loose it was almost falling off so what I ended up going to get was this park tool eight millimeter wrench here I didn't have that size on my little tool that I usually bring with me so I bought this and it's i'm actually glad i did because it's much bigger and much easier to get the proper amount of torque you need to tighten this stay bolt into your lower um, crank pedal set here uh, it is an eight millimeter size i'll leave a link to this particular allen set uh, this allen wrench that i bought it's a park tool and i really love park tools stuff they're just really good quality it's only ten dollars like i said i'll have an amazon link there in the description if you're interested but it, it is an eight millimeter size and I lost the little plastic bushing that goes inside of here to protect this. Now you don't really need it because there's a metal flange on this bolt that protects the interior from moisture and dirt. Um, I can show you on the other side here what it looks like with that plastic cover. So I ordered a new set of those bolts on Amazon. I'll also have a link to that in the description as well, just so that I can replace this plastic bushing basically. But if you guys haven't already be sure that you check this bolt because it will loosen over time especially if you're heavier like i am at 225 pounds when you put your weight onto this crank shaft it will just ever so slightly start to loosen and you're more than likely going to see your left side get loose before your right side and the reason why is because you're pushing against the tightening of this bolt on the other side as you pedal you're actually tightening and this is all one piece here so this crank piece is all part of your uh, front sprocket basically with these larger connections so that side is not as likely to come loose as this side is and I've had this happen on multiple bikes it's always the left side for me for some reason but get this crank it down nice and tight you want to get that almost as tight as you possibly can unlike a lot of other bolts on your bike they don't need to be that tight but this is holding all of your weight on there and so you want to make sure you have the right tool for the job so i'm going to keep this in my backpack so that anytime i have an issue with this loosening again i can tighten it because you can get it pretty tight i was trying to finger tighten it and hand tighten it along the way to keep this from wobbling and coming off but i tell you what it just was not nearly enough and i wish that i had this tool with me so double check both sides of your bolts they're going to be a little bit loose even the right side was just slightly loose and so i tightened it up with this allen remember it's an eight millimeter size it took me a while to find out exactly what size this was eight millimeter bolt head here and i will leave a link in the description for the replacement bolts that come with this shroud here that this piece of plastic that keeps dirt and debris from going inside and rusting that bolt out but eight millimeters the size you want be sure you just crank that down as tight as you possibly can don't bend the allen bar obviously and you don't want to strip it but it can take a lot of pressure it's a heavy duty bolt with steel so make sure you get that nice and tight on both sides otherwise it'll loosen up over time and you'll have issues and let me know in the comments below if you've had this issue on this bike or any other bike as well thanks for watching and we'll see you on the next one